Good morning, Diva Dolls. It is Tuesday, February the 18th, I believe. And I'm back in here at the gym. Um, I had to push myself this morning to come in here because I needed to use their scale. I have a new um, pedometer that I want to share with you all. But in order for me to set it up properly, I had to measure my steps. So I did that yesterday while I was at work. And then this morning, I wanted to use the scale that I always use, which is the electronic scale that's hooked up to a um, computer out there. So I um, got up and got in here. Unfortunately, I didn't get in here exactly at 5, so I'm pressed for time because I have to work. But I um, got my car out because, yeah, we still have frozen mountains of snow. And um, anyway, I got my car out. So that was part of the damn workout as well. But I got had to come in here and measure, weigh myself. I could have went by the doctor's office, but um, I don't like their scale. It's the one, you old-fashioned one, you get on and you push the thing over and you tap, tap, tap. No. So I needed to, to get in here anyway and get a workout in. Um, the gym is not mandatory to get your workout on because you can always do a DVD. Um, if you have Comcast, you can pull that up. Um, sorry about the TV in the background, but it's the news, and I'm in here. And normally I don't come in this room, but as you notice, as I'm moving like I'm on the side backs, which I am, the background is different. It's because I'm in a different room. I'm in the ladies' hut of Gold's Gym and since there was nobody in here this morning I decided to come in here and I'm only doing 20 minutes today because I just finished working on doing some lunges holding 12 and a half pounds of weight in each hand and I normally don't do lunges because of my knees but I said I'm gonna start doing something different um, I'm not discouraged with my weight because I'm steady holding. But I know that in order for me to get out of this plateau that I'm stuck in, I need to do different stuff. I need to switch up what I'm doing. So that's what I did today. I came in here and um, I started working with the weights. Um, did some lunges. Then I, um, I used the arm extension. And then I did the row machine. And that's all upper body. And I decided to get on my buddy here, Cybex, which they have us in this room too, which is cool. And um, they have pretty much have everything you need in here, um, whether it's the bike, two different kinds, whether or not you want to use the free weights. Um, so there's plenty of stuff in here to work on, and there was nobody here. And I can record and talk to you without people in my face. But anyway, I'm only doing 20 minutes on this machine today. It's only because I've done my weights. So I'm good with that. So once I get off of this, the only thing left to do is work on um, another upper machine. And I may even do the machines. Um, I forgot the name of it. When you sit on it and you put the thing in between your leg and you push your legs out that way, working on your outer thighs, then you switch it, put it in. And then you squeeze it in to work on the inner. So I may do that. And I always do five sets of ten on whatever weight that I'm doing. On the row, I had it on 50. On the arm extension, I had it on 40. And it may not sound like much, but you don't need much. Because as you're doing your sets, each set gets a little harder. So it's good for me. And I did a few lunges. I didn't overdo it. Um, I did also did some arm extensions, working on this part of my arm. Um, so anywho, I'm just switching it up. And I'm not going to weigh myself anymore until my birthday. But I'm going to keep at it. And that's what you're supposed to do. Don't worry about the numbers on the scale. Pay attention to your clothes. Pay attention to how you feel. And... Even though I had to drag my ass out of here, 
I'm already at the point in my workout where I'm like, damn, I'm glad that I came because this afternoon I would have been just mentally exhausted. I got a lot going on, and yesterday while I was at work, I could not wait for 5 o'clock to come. I was like, oh, my God. I mean, excuse me, 4 o'clock to come. I can't take it. So around about 2, my body starts shutting down. The numbers start squinching together. I was like, hell, I got to get out of here. So I didn't waste any time. Five minutes to four, a sister was packing up. So I didn't want to have any excuses today. I just got in here and got it done. And I'm so thankful that I did. But this also will allow me to bring you a separate video um, showing you my pedometer. And why I'm so excited about it is because I love to walk. I can walk my ass off. Doesn't matter how big I am. I can always outwalk a motherfucker. Trust me when I tell you. Um, I may not be at the jogging stage yet, but that's my goal. And I'm going to get there. Woo! But anywho, um, the app, the, the pedometer that I got, it's a map my walk pedometer. It measures your calories, your distance. Um, there's three things, your calorie, your steps, and your distance, and you can sync it with the Map My Walk app, which I have on my phone, and you can or either hook up to your computer, whatever Map My Walk app you pull up. You can sync it, and it saves your information, but I will get into specs about that in a separate video, but that's why I'm glad I got in here to get this done, because I wanted to have my correct weight when I enter it in. I measured my steps yesterday at work. Um, so that's done. So I'm ready to enter my data into it, and I'm good with that. But anyway, y'all, I will share my calorie, total calories burned at the end of this, down the description bar of this video. And I'm only doing 20 minutes, so I'm only estimating about. Uh, 400 calories, maybe more, because you can burn. And like I told you before, ever for me, because I've been doing this and I pay attention to the to the calories as they're burned. Every five minutes, I can burn 100 minimum up to 110, 115 on calories. So um, I've been talking. I'm not sure if I've been pushing hard enough. So I'm just going to say 100 for my 20 minute workout so it'll be a total of 400 and that's not including what I've done with the weights and the, and the lunges but it's all in the workout and I'm good with it so anywho I am going to shut this video off and as you can see um, 20 minutes I'm almost halfway through so I should be approaching 200 calories and I know I'll hit over 400 because I'm at 196 and I still got a minute before I hit a minute and 10 or 11 before I hit the halfway mark so I'll know that I'll hit probably at least 450 with this workout anywho y'all get it in do what you can every little bit counts this winter it will pass spring it will come and winter you don't want I mean, excuse me the summer you don't want to be discouraged and be in the same place that you are right now so every little thing that you do whether it's a pound two pounds or ten pounds keep pushing and accept what you what you're doing as long as you're not gaining because if you're gaining then something's not right you're not doing something right and that means you need to get refocused realigned all right, I'm at 10.22, and I'm halfway through my my workout, and um, I just wanted to chat with you all this morning. Hopefully all is well. Get up, get it in. Praise God that we're up and alive and well. I thank him for that. I'm halfway through my workout. We're at 10, and I am at 2.27. So yeah, it'll be about 4, 450 for this workout. I'll holler at y'all in the next video. Peace.